Marilyn, a friend of ours, got this little rescue dog a couple years ago. She was very old. Her name is Rosie. And like I said, she was very old when she was selected at the rescue place. And she faced the wall. She turned away from all the people that came in. All the other dogs would jump up and down and go, pick me, pick me. And Rosie didn't. She just was too proud to uh, beg. So Marilyn decided to pick her, the one that didn't want any attention, blind and deaf, and brought her home and gave her all this love. And they'd walk down the street, and Rosie couldn't see where she was going or hear anything. One time, she was moving just a hair faster than she normally did, which is snail space. I said, Marilyn, Rosie's sprinting. Look at that. That's amazing. And this is a little dog that a trainer at the Apple store emailed me when he found that I was painting dogs and writing this little book about dog stories and, and uh, dog paintings. He said, paint my dog. So this cute little dog with these horned rim glasses. I changed the color of the horned rim glasses and I changed the tie. There's the dog that the family is crazy about. <clears throat> Father, mother, brothers, sisters, they all have bulldogs. And the father was just crazy about this charcoal sketch I did of one of their bulldogs. <laughs> I had so much fun and thank God for these trainers that, that uh, they get very interested in helping me when they have dogs and they love dogs and I do a painting of their dogs and they tell me dog stories that I can put in my dog book and um, and pictures that I can do paintings and I took this with still with my digital camera to do a painting from I'll show you the painting now here it comes I chose these rich browns to go with her beautiful colored face what a gorgeous dog